Now, proceed to second question. Find the acute angle between line Q and line R. Before this, we already find our Q. Uh, line Q vector is B2, which is negative I plus J minus 2K. And form our equation of, our Cartesian equation of line R, we have the vector, assume that vector 3 is equal to, so here we have, x minus 2 divided by 2, so this is 2i, but for the second one, this is not in terms of our y minus k yet. So we need to simplify as negative y minus 1, that is negative 1, so we have negative y plus 1, so it can be written as y plus 1 over negative 1. So the vector for component j is equal to negative j and the component k which is equal to 3k. So now we rewrite our component j in terms of y minus k divided by negative y minus a2 divided by b2. So this is vector r. So to find the acute angle, use the cos. Theta equal to at cos b2 dot v3 divided by magnitude of v2 times magnitude of v3. So we have v2 is equal to negative i minus plus j minus 2k. So the magnitude of v2 is equal to square root of negative 1 square plus 1 square plus negative 2 square, which is equal to 6. And magnitude for V3, so V3 is equal to 2i minus j plus 3k. So we have the magnitude for V3 is equal to square root of 2 square plus negative 1 square plus 3 square which is equal to 14. And the dot product for V2 dot V3 is equal to negative 1, 1, negative 2, dot with 2, negative 1, 3. So we have negative 2, minus 1, minus 6, which is equal to negative 9. Okay. Substitute into our formula. So we have Cos at cos negative 9 divided by set 6 times set 14. So the answer is equal to. Press your calculator, then we have 169.10. So remember the question asks for acute angle. Why we get this answer? Okay, now try to illustrate our answer. So assuming this is line Q with vector 2, and this is your line R with vector 3. So the question asks for theta. So it can be here or it can be here. So now we have obtuse angle. So this is actually 169.10. Okay, now we need to find an acute angle. So how to find 
theta for acute angle. So theta for acute angle is actually equal to 180. So this is all 180 minus with 169.10. So the answer is equal to 10.8. Nine because question asks for acute angle, so the answer for theta can be uh, obtuse angle or can be acute angle. It depends on our question. So this is example three.